Hello everybody, this is Intrepid83 and welcome back to Let's Play Need for Speed Underground 2. Alright, uh, looking at the map here, I'm actually thinking about going back to the city core. I was thinking maybe go up to the uh, street cross, do the two street crosses up here and then, uh, and then, you know, maybe go up to the sprint or whatever, but there's a couple of drift races up there and that leaves a huge travel distance to the next race should we need the, should we have the extra time. So I think I'm going to go head down to the city core again and start working on those circuits and the uh, street cross down there and then uh, see how things go there. So anyways, first up, let's head to this one. So let's head back to the city core and... Uh, See what awaits us there. I missed the island. <laughs> right. And here we are. All right. From Dana. I'll make it quick. You put in the bank and we provide the course route. You offer some real races? Sure. Let's go. Lexus, an RSX, and looks like a Skyline. And get the feeling that launch may have had to do some of the fact that it started on the uh, sidewalk. <laughs> Angelo! Not anymore. Right, let's focus on the road in front. Of us. <laughs> so I don't regret saying that. Or I'll do my best to not regret saying that. But They've definitely given me a challenge this date, that's for sure. Drift! That, however, would have gotten me none. <laughs> and they're right there again. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh. As terrifying as those, uh, the, as those road that as that road is, it's actually kind of fun <laughs> to drive through there. It's almost like a drift, and you know, it's basically going back and forth and trying to avoid the traffic.
Let's not go too nuts on the nice this time around. Too afraid to uh, too much too much of a too much of a chicken was to hit the nos down going in, into these. <laughs> close. <laughs> I underestimated the handling of the car that time. <laughs> definitely not a, uh, definitely got away with that there, turning, uh, turning across the road just over the crest before I could see what was coming. And there we go. Five minutes, well, just a shade under. Five minutes, five seconds, 200 reputation, 2,000 bucks. All right. Next up, uh, do I want to do the street cross or do I want the circuit? Yeah, the street cross is more or less along the way, so let's go for the street cross. Uh, let's go this way. Sometimes the GPS is worth following. Philip, dog, you even got seatbelts in that pile. If you if you do, you're gonna need them, or else we get tossed out of your ride. This is street cross, and it's straight up fierce. You're gonna pull some major G's if you want to play. All right, Philip, I'm in. Because at some point I could take this car up to nine stars as well. That was good lunch. <laughs> okay, that was a little fun. <laughs> More than a little, actually. <laughs> I'm surprised I took that turn the right way. Let's see if I can keep doing that. A little too close on the inside. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is the hairpin. There we go. <laughs> and I turned it too late, but. I suppose it wasn't too horrendous. As soon as I managed to keep it off the wall. Take it. I'm 
guess the lab last lap I was closer to taking it properly than I thought it was. Alright, last lap. Back and forth, back and forth. <laughs> I wasn't kidding when I said the street crosses this car is bread and butter. I mean, it's just so reliable. Anyways, and here we go. When it gets to 350Z, Sentra, and Mustang GT, I actually managed to say it the Canadian way this time. <laughs> All right, 300 reputation and 2,000 bucks. All right, let's keep going. All right, so we've got a circuit. Ooh, and we've got the new uh, uh, Underground Racing League race. Um, all right, let's go take out the circuit race here. Let's get the feeling, oh, we might have enough time for, this, for the Underground Racing League. Ah! There we go. <laughs> let's actually get this car going first before I start through trying to uh, look at the... Uh, clock and the map and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, I think I'll uh, save the underground race and the race for now. Alright, let's do this. Maybe we'll do it next time. Alright, just so we go. I know we've got enough time to finish it, you know. Some of them are getting pretty lengthy, so. Anyways, from Jamie. Whoa, dog, you ain't seriously thinking about bringing that heap into this race, are you? I don't want to risk my win because I have to avoid your sad ride when I lap you. Pay attention to the map and stay out of my way. Alright, Jamie. Let's go. Okay, it took me a second there to figure out where were we in the city and which direction we were going. <laughs> Wasn't sure if it was going to turn until the last seconds. Sidewalks kind of uh, foiled my attempts to break there. <laughs> uh, the rough terrain. Let's see how we do down here. Okay, maybe this is the better route. Let's we'll treat it like a chicane instead of two separate turns. Full throttle and successfully. They're still right behind me. So somebody already took out the barrels. And got lucky there. Ooh. 
Alright, final lap. Ugh, gonna hit the curbs. Ugh. Oh, that was close. <laughs> <laughs> I I saw maybe a, a glare of headlights coming over the, uh, the hill there. Finish line. Never mind. Uh. And victory. Yeah, 200 reputation. Do this much? I actually thought. I was thinking maybe I might have actually gotten the full 300 reputation for that victory. But no. Kind of surprised to see the 10 second gap, but anyways, there we go. Alright, got a couple of minutes left. We've unlocked carbon fiber hoods. Uh, you know what? You know what? Let's, uh, what do we gotta do? Specialty shop? Let's, uh, let's take this thing to nine stars. Um, where do I want to go for it? Uh, let's go to the body shop as soon as I can get myself all right, properly all right take a look at the uh, carbon hoods and then we'll uh, go to the uh, car specialty shop and take this thing to nine stars Actually, out of curiosity hmm yeah it's not oh wait I'm looking for but this one, no. All right, I guess maybe I haven't gotten the uh, the call from Rachel yet. But, uh... What's wrong, mate? <laughs> oh well. Take a quick look at the hoods. Obviously, they're probably just going to be the uh, the third set of carbon or the carbon fiber variants of the third set of the regular hoods. So let's just take a quick look at them. So yeah, uh, so they got the tsunami, slingshot, Colex, Aerobex, Synchromax, Sybil, DJM Hide, and Eraser. So there we go. All right, I'm going to head down to the uh, car specialty shop and I'll meet you there. Hey dude, I got some good news and some bad news. The sponsor wants your ride on the cover of the DVD Black Top Bandits. Bad news is it's written in your contract. Good news is you're going to get paid for it. Just build a 10 star car You'll land the DVD cover and the cash. And that is the car, uh, the, the call I've been waiting for, for the 10 star rating. Hey, accessorize your ride with style and turn some heads when you race by upgrading your car's looks and audio right here. All right, to get this thing to nine, star, nine stars, I will be putting the, I will be doing the specialty doors and I will be doing the third, oops, the third trunk layout. 
which is this one. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know what? I think I might actually take my time with this. I'll take care of it all off screen. And next time we will see the final result. This is Intrepid83 signing off. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Be blessed. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit the like button on your way out. Uh, hit the subscribe button as well if you haven't done so already. And be sure to hit the uh, like the bell icon to let you know when uh, I up to upload the next video. And you can follow me on Twitter for any channel updates. I'm at Intrepid83. Have a good one.